everyone. Welcome to another episode of Defiance Rebels. I'm Plain Pants, and we are going to introduce today Officer Dan. Not Lieutenant Dan, Officer Dan. Officer Dan from two episodes ago. Congratulations, Dan. Well, well deserved. And also in honor of Dan, while we talk about um, some stuff that's been going on in the task force, you know, basically, we're at the point where we are killing it on Foxtrot, but really, really struggling on Stronghold. And uh, according to guys like Ben Tim and others, Stronghold is really where you have to start uh, transitioning to using all uh, Zuka raids, um, which we don't do. So here, Lieutenant Dan is a transfer from another task force, and he is proficient in the all Zuka strategy. So we're going to watch him do this. All right. I could do that. I think. Here's where it would get tricky for me. Because when it comes to smoke screen... Oh, that doesn't look like it's going very well. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly how I would do it. <laughs> I could do this. Yeah, no, I could definitely do this. Yeah, I could definitely do that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, truly, man, welcome, Dan. I'm just busting your balls. <laughs> uh, but seriously, I think I could do that. <laughs> but but honestly, we do have to get better at that uh, at that higher strategy stuff. So. I think there's going to be a lot of growing pains like that. I think we may even have to consider dropping down to an easier operation or something like that um, so that we can get really good at those sniping mis missions. And because uh, then we'll be we'll be cruising on stronghold and even the game thinks that curtain call is in the normal range. Which again, I don't know. I think that's <laughs> I think that's being generous. But if we had really good tactical upgrade, maybe maybe we could be at curtain call in the next couple of months. I don't know. All I know is I think it's good. We we got that. We got a fresh injection of ideas, um, and now I think we're poised for potential growth. But I think the next couple of missions might be painful. But I think it's worth it. I think it's a growing pain. We'll start to notice changes in our task force, if you know what I mean. <laughs> All right, I think I'll, uh, I think I'll just stop there. No, 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 I'm not stopping there. I want to show another attack, which was great. It was the last attack. Okay, <laughs> this one... This one has something for everyone. You have level 10 tanks, which is iffy, and you have grenadiers, and you have medics. Are you feeling me? Are you sensing what's gonna happen here? What all we're gonna see? I think you know I'm talking about a medic retreat. But not before some serious theatrics. <laughs> Alright, so 
If you've noticed, all we got so far are the tanks and the medics. The Grenadiers have not been launched. They are the secret weapon. <laughs> Here they come. So I don't know if anyone could see what could be wrong with this idea and they're gone. <laughs> <laughs> and now we have level 10 tanks going up against <laughs> some cannons, which is a fair matchup if the tanks probably were a little higher. Actually, that was pretty good. I stand corrected. That part was good. And, and, and. <laughs> and the medic retreat. Oh man, happy Sunday to us all. Later folks. <laughs>